Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a haul video. As you know, I'm going on holiday, so I've been shopping to get a few bits for that. And, um, just a few bits that I wanted. Hi, um, I'm just cutting into this video because I've had to cut um, a section out because the audio was like corrupt and it was replaying over the top of everything and I couldn't figure it out but basically I was just showing you I just showed a black top that I had already bought and then I was saying and this is the next thing I bought so that's why it doesn't quite flow for this bit and it was really annoying that I had to cut also, it out. So this top from New Look which is really nice Connor pointed out that he liked this so then when I went in and needed a top I thought oh, I'll get this one and I do really like it so it has like rope straps and I think this is called crochet when it's kind of a bit of a thicker material with like holes in it and it's just kind of like a plain vest but I thought it would look lovely with either shorts or tucked into a denim skirt that's that so moving on to the stuff that I bought today um the first thing I bought is from New Look which I'm not really sure why all of the denim skirts were on sale like every single one in a line mini every color they were all on sale and i'm not sure if it's because they're going out of fashion or whatever but i don't care because i absolutely love them like i think they're such a great piece to have in your wardrobe you can style them with so many stuff you can dress them up dress them down wear them in winter wear them in summer like i absolutely love them and i currently have a black one from next which i wear all the time um so i thought i would get this one which is just a normal blue denim the buttons are real they button all the way down this is the A-line. I'm not a mini skirt kind of person. <laughs> this is the A-line. And this was meant to be £20 and was in the sale for £9.99. Like, £9.99. How? Like, I was so excited. Like, you would pay £10 for a skirt like this in Primark. Like, I love it. And, yeah. Like, this with... Where's the top gone? The orange top would look super, super cute. So, this will definitely be coming on holiday with me. I got two more denim bits, both from Topshop. The first being this pair of shorts. I needed a pair of shorts because of, I didn't have any that fit me. I have a pair that are the same size I am now from last year when I went to Egypt. But for some reason, they're really, really small. Like, I can't even really get them over my legs. So, I'm not really sure because they're exactly the same size as this pair I've just bought today. So, I don't really understand. Um, I wanted a pair of shorts that weren't really, really short. I don't know if you can tell, but these aren't majorly short. I'm going to do a holiday uh, clothing lookbook, so I'll definitely have them on in that so you'll be able to see. And I'd originally wanted the mum shorts, but I saw these, which are the Ashley Ultimate Vintage Mid-Rise. They were £28, and I loved them, and I tried them on, and they're really nice. They have little bits of, like, distressedness on the pockets of the back, and obviously around the bottom but yeah i really really liked them and i tried them on and they were really comfortable and they're not super high-waisted um but they are still quite high-waisted so yeah i really like those and i was really happy that they're 28 pounds because i think the mum ones that i'd looked at were about 38 so they were cheaper for me and the next thing is my favorite thing that i have bought oh my god i got the mum jeans from topshop now before i talk about them i'm not really sure i tried on a pair of johnny jeans and i usually get a waist 30 leg 30 i usually get my jeans from miss selfridge um but for some reason i don't think there's a miss selfridge in leeds city center anymore i couldn't see it today um so i tried i got the waist 30 leg 30 in top shop and it fit fine in the johnny super high waist jeans and then i tried the waist 30 in these and they were really like tight so I got the waist 32 leg 30 and they fit fine. Um, I think it could be because Johnny jeans are stretchier and these are more of a kind of solid denim. Um, but yeah, it might just be me, but just a little note to make sure that you know that. So I'll show you the jeans. They are so, so nice. They're all distressed and you can either wear them rolled up or not rolled up or rolled up higher or not rolled up as high. All of that. But I buy a leg 30. I should probably buy a leg 32. Like I don't know if you can... I can't lift my leg up, but I buy my jeans short. Um, it drives my friends insane that I buy my jeans short, but I just like them to be shorter. Um, so I'll probably definitely roll them up, but you can wear them not rolled up or rolled up or, yeah, and they're just plain on the back. And I absolutely love them. They were £45, so they were quite expensive, but I absolutely love them. And I haven't owned a pair of jeans that haven't just been skinny high waist jeans for absolutely ages. So 
so excited also never owned ripped jeans so the next place and the final place i want is victoria's secret if you get offended by seeing people's underwear which we all have to wear um just as much as we have to wear a t-shirt we have to wear underwear if you get offended by that then just click out the video it's victoria's secret it's obviously going to be underwear um i personally get excited about buying underwear i absolutely love underwear like so much i have so much underwear um so i want to show it and i like them and i want to show them so just click out if you don't want to see that um the first things are actually underwear the first two things there was a huge sale it was like the mid it's called mid annual i'm not sure what it's called does it turn here no it just says sale um so the first thing was this makeup bag i have always looked at these all the time when i go in victoria's secret the clear makeup bags with the stripes that have the little victoria's secret and i saw this green color and fell in love like i think it's so so pretty this should have been 24 pounds and where's my sheet? it was in the sale for six pounds i think 24 pounds for a makeup bag is so 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 expensive like more expensive than needed for a makeup bag this is kind of like a medium sized makeup bag like it's not huge i could probably fit what i'm going to use if i was going to connor's or i'm going to see if i can fit the stuff i want to take on holiday in it um but i'm not really sure if i will um but yeah i don't also own a plastic makeup bag so having a plastic one's helpful because if anything leaks or anything you can kind of just wipe it and i've wanted one of these for ages but not wanted to spend the money so when the sale came around i was very happy also got a phone case which i am super excited about i've had a victoria's secret phone case before for my old phone i had the pink and white stripe here just plain victoria's secret one um but this is the flex and protect hard case iphone 6 slash 6s um and they had this case in a few different colors they had it in like a black with pink and orange and like a white with a green and blue and then all the other cases they had were just the same like black and uh, white and navy blue stripes with, like a bow on it and i didn't really like it she said they did have some of the pink and white stripy ones in a couple of days previous but they didn't have any and i loved this one so i'm gonna get it out to show you um i like about this case is i already had it out of the box but on the back it's like rock solid hard but the sides are flexible and the case also goes the whole way around the case i have now is just like a snap-on um mac jacobs case and my ted baker case is also the same so it doesn't cover the whole of the top or the whole of the bottom like it just covers around the little corner bits so if you drop it and it lands like i have chips on the top of my phone from it so this case covers everything and i think these are definitely the best sort of phone cases to get and with it being hard on the back and soft on the edges it's easy to get in just as the little victoria secret thing on the side um yeah i love that and that was meant to be 20 pounds and it was five pounds five pounds if they would have had other ones that i would have liked i would have bought like a few because i think that's such good value and i'm constantly changing my phone case like not so much now i've had my new phone because i don't have as many cases but i would always change my cases on my 5c so i'm excited to put this on i'm gonna put it on after this video but five pound i was so 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 excited the rest of the stuff is underwear i'll start with the one victoria secret thing i got which is this bra which oh my god is the softest material the softest i love it um this is called the perfect coverage now this is a full cup bra now if you don't know what that means it means it literally covers i'm not gonna be able to show you it literally covers the whole of your boob like this bit touches your skin so you don't have any of your boob out which i'm not like i've never owned a bra like this before but i saw this bra and fell in love with the pattern it's like a tealy color it has navy blue little frillage and a bow and then leopard print and it's just plain on the back um so i didn't really care that it was a full bra because i liked the color of it and i wear a lot of t-shirts and obviously with work i will want a comfy bra but oh my god this is the comfiest thing i've ever put on in my entire life it's the softest material it's so 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 comfy my mum tried one on as well and said this is the comfiest thing um yeah but it it covers the whole boob but that's not that's not an issue for me and this should have been 39 pound 50 and it was in the sale for 19 pounds 50 so that's like 20 pounds off which is so good because i usually buy my bras from boo avenue um which is kind of expensive and kind of like reasonable at the same time um it's not victoria's secret prices but then it's kind of like a decent brand um 
and this is cheaper than the bras I buy in there so in the sale if I would have had more money I would have had a hundred bras <laughs> like spent so 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 much money but yeah so I love that one and then the rest of the stuff I got was from pink why is my bag stuck in there so I got this bra in the same colour because I love this colour and I'm kind of upset I didn't get the pants to match this I know they do pants to match it they weren't in the sale but they're like the big flowery pattern um, and this is just called the push up um, and it's pink on the inside and this is just kind of just a normal plain normal bra in this lovely teal mini colour plain at the back but it's so comfy like I'm not a push up bra kind of person like I don't really own any push up bras but I kind of look at bras for the like pattern and what's going on rather than what it is like I don't like really 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 majorly low cut bras but um for me i didn't really care it was push up i know the push up's okay it's not like i need push like i need or want push up um but yeah i really really like this bra and it should have been 34 pound 50 and was in the sale for 17 pounds this has been reduced twice it had gone down to 24 and then was at 70. So that's also another big saving and it's a super comfy bra. And I've never owned a Victoria's Secret or a Victoria's Secret pink bra before. The next one is, I thought this was the same. So I picked this up thinking, oh, that's cute. I have a pair of Topshop pants that are this colour with this exact flower pattern on them um, from Topshop. And I was like, oh, that would go so well. So I picked it up. I tried the green one and I was like, oh yeah, that one will fit. It's the same size. It's the same bra. Mum was like, oh, the back of this bra is nice. So I was like, oh, it's different. So this is more of a kind of bralette at the back. So it's like that and it's super pretty and it fastens at the front. So you like kind of, you like unclasps there and you kind of like put it on like a t-shirt. But I just thought that was so, so pretty. It's also pink on the inside of the cup but oh my god it was so pretty i love it with the little lace bralette bit i love it and i don't think this has a price from before on it it does oh it does 38 pounds down to so this didn't have as much of a reduction it was down to 25 pound 50 um but yes yeah, so it's the most expensive bra i bought but i absolutely love it like i think that's gonna look so so pretty and i'm gonna try it on after this video because i didn't actually try it on the final bra I bought was this and I love this. So for starters, I've never owned a red bra. So I thought, oh, this is really pretty. I love the pink, what's it called? Like the band that says pink. And the back of this bra, this is also the push up and so is the burgundy one. Look how pretty. It still has adjustable straps, which I love. I thought it wasn't going to have adjustable straps. And as you can see with this top where I keep pulling my strap up, the straps on a top are really annoying for me. Like, the straps always seem to be too big on everything. But this does still have adjustable straps. And these, you're not going to be able to get the gist of it. But when you have the bra on, these kind of, not spread out, like they still obviously stay together. But they look super pretty on your back. This one also unclasp at the front i've never had a, a clasping at the front bra but i think that's such a good idea um yeah also super super comfy super pretty i love the if the, this should be a bikini top like i feel like this should be a bikini top it'd look so cute as a bikini top um so yeah, that's that and then the final little thing i got we were moseying around pink and they had some of the pants on sale for three pounds and they usually does it say on here seven pound and I love the pants with the, I don't know what this is called, it's kind of like a boxers, like what's on boys boxers, the band. I have a Victoria's Secret pair that say Victoria's Secret all the way around. And I love this little pattern. And I thought it could kind of tie in with any of the kind of, the minty green kind of things because it has greeny colours. And it's just a, just a thong at the back. But yeah, this is £3, I thought, for £3 you can't go wrong. And I would have bought loads more. But I have a ridiculous amount of pants. I'm going to stop throwing them around in your face now. So that is all for this video. I hope you've enjoyed this haul. Be looking out for my next videos. Um, I'm really enjoying filming at the minute. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And make sure you subscribe if you didn't. All my social media links will be in the below bar. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.